remember Dolly, the sheep clone that got worldwide attention, and as you know, she also triggered fears that humans would be next. Well, now some scientists say that's not a bad idea if it's done right. Here's CNN's Elizabeth Cohen. After Dolly was born, many world leaders and scientists reacted with caution. 19 European countries banned human cloning, and the scientists who helped create Dolly said that making a copy of a human was wrong. Put very simply, this is because I think that we should treat each child as an individual. And if you deliberately set out to make a copy of somebody, then you are no longer treating the child as an individual. Wilmot's remarks were made at the annual meeting of the American Association for the Advancement of Science. But bioethicists here said there is a way to clone people and do it ethically. So we've got to find a way to regulate cloning that allows some families to use it, but keeps the wrong families from putting it to bad use. McGee says human cloning could be done if handled like an adoption, where there's a rigorous screening process. We can use something like that same kind of pre-screening with cloning one day if it ever becomes safe. We've got to think ahead about the regulatory model. The bioethicists here said that there should be regulations to ensure that families can handle the potential problems of raising a child who looks exactly like one of his parents. Consider, for example, the ramifications of cloning Art Kaplan, director of the Center for Bioethics at the University of Pennsylvania Health Systems. What's really the ethical problem with that is how are they going to deal with the burden of looking exactly like me? People might look at them in 30 years and say, are, are you interested in ethics? Um, are you a good speaker? Um, do you write much? And they may say, well, gosh, I don't do any of those things. My dad did that, but I don't want to do any of that. Kaplan says despite claims from a Chicago physicist that he's ready to clone humans, the tools to do it commercially won't exist for probably many years. Elizabeth Cohen, CNN, Philadelphia.